Hey guys, Faith here. So I have some pretty exciting things I would love to share with you guys. First of all, I'm going to tell you guys about how my Halloween went. So, Kayla and her mom picked me up. Her mom took us to her friend Lucas's house so that she can help me finish getting my costume all ready and everything. I decided to dress up as a kitty cat this year. I just wore, like, one of my black shirts, a pair of black leggings, and a pair of my Converse. I just wore my cat ears, and she had, like, a cat tail and a little white, stretchy choker type thing. It had, like, a bow on it had a bell and I just wore my walking dead jacket because it was actually kind of cold outside but after she helped me get ready me her and Lucas went to the Lanier mansion so that we can wait on our friend or my friend sorry Derek to show up because she was planning on meeting us there and then we saw some girl kind of walking towards the place, and I thought, is that her? But I didn't want to come out and ask her, because that would be awkward, just in case it wasn't her. But it ended up being her. So, me, her, Kayla, and Lucas started going from house to house, asking for candy. And oh my god, downtown, they give out so much freaking candy every year, I just didn't even notice that. Well, I mean, because growing up, I always went around the da the Hanover area to go trick-or-treating. Because my mom and dad, they would either drop us off and Grandpa would take us trick-or-treating, Grandpa and Grandma, or they, or they would just come over themselves with us and stay, and then we all go trick-or-treating together. So I've mostly been around Hanover trick-or-treating more than anything else. I went downtown very few times to go trick or treating. But yeah, like, oh my god. I had to bring, I had to put the candy in my purse because apparently I forgot to bring a plastic bag or some sort of bag to use to put the candy in. That was a stupid idea on my part, but hey, mistakes happen, right? Then. Kayla and her mom took me back home. I thought I was going to stay the night, but I guess her mom didn't want anybody staying night. At least not that night. But I ended up getting to watch wrestling and eat my candy. Even though my brother hogged most of it up. Swear to God, brothers, am I right? Sucks, really. It was a lot of fun. Also... You guys should comment down below tell me how your all's Halloween was, or what you guys did, or whatever. I will read them, and I will try to reply to as many as I possibly can. Because I really would like to hear your, your Halloween stories, and, or experiences, or whatever. But then Wednesday, my brother and I got to spend some time with our dad again. We just went to uh, Walmart. I had to stay in the car because my dad's girlfriend got a German Shepherd puppy, so we brought her with us because we didn't want to leave her in the house and have her end up chewing on stuff or, you know, doing her business in the house. So we decided to bring her along. We couldn't leave the dog in the car by herself, so I had to stay in and watch her. I actually kept me pretty occupied because I was uh, playing with her for a while. But I asked my dad to get a Venom Energy drink over there because I found out they sold them at Walmart again. Apparently my dad couldn't find it. I'm like, Dad, I swear to God. I told him where it was. But I asked my dad, I was like, can I just go in and get one real quick? If you gave me the money, he gave me like $2. So I went in there. I found one. I was like, I told you that they had them. So I told him I got back out. But I ended up paying for it. And I was kind of distracted because I was looking at the clearance racks 
from the leftover Halloween stuff that they had. And my dad's like, let me guess, you're looking at the freaking clothes again. And I'm like, maybe. <laughs> he knows me so well. But yeah. Also, on the 9th of November, which is actually five days now, my dad's wanting to go out to eat and maybe do something for my birthday. I don't know what all we're going to do yet. But I'm really going to have some fun, so I'm really excited. Speaking of birthdays, officially a week from today will be my birthday, and I'm just really excited about it. I know I've been talking to you guys a lot about it. I apologize. I just really love birthdays. I always have. Plus, you get to have cake and ice cream, and to get presents, and spend time with your friends and family, and and it's also the only time of the year where you get a billion freaking timeline posts on Facebook from people wishing you happy birthday. Because I swear to God, any other time, I would get none. So that makes me feel even more special. I might be making a vlog tomorrow, hopefully. It depends on how the weather is. If it's not rainy or extremely cold or anything then I'll probably go but if it ends up being rainy or too cold or something I probably won't go but if I get to I will make a vlog for you guys because I really been needing to go back up to Big Lots and Family Dollar anyway so I can get a few things maybe but yeah we'll see I think that's about it for this video that's all I wanted to talk to you guys about today so I love you guys. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.